Coming to you live from the Contaminated Dungeon, it's Max the Animal and Nikki Snacks here on Bagels and Locks. Good morning, good morning, and welcome to Bagels and Locks. I'm your host, Max the Animal, joined by my overzealous partner, Nikki Snacks. Spell overzealous. O V E R Z E A L O U S. Can I spell it? I believe so. I believe so. <laughs> And where did I leave off? Uh, and we will, and go. as always, as always, and as always, we will be giving you our best bets for this week's NFL action. Week thirteen. Week thirteen. It's crazy. It's crazy that we've gotten this far, um, and it's crazy that you guys are still joining us. So also, thank you. Just appreciate all the viewers out there. You guys are still watching. Obviously, it's got to be tough when you got this. Far guy go 0 and 3 almost every week also stop me if you heard this before i had another winning week two and one wow stop. what i've heard that before oh yeah that's true see what i did there it's true yeah they say stop thing, if you heard it one of the first things you've gotten right on this show everything i bet today do the opposite it's not a terrible strategy Just do the opposite it's not a terrible it's strategy. a down year that's all i got it's a, it's just a down year but i did some meditation this week so I, i'm feeling good it makes me super nervous. Super nervous when you know he's not actually screaming and running around like a maniac. All right, two and one. Actually, three and one last week if we're including Thanksgiving. Oh, by the way, I went one and three. Yeah. One and three if we're including Thanksgiving. So not well, I got to win. I got to win. Not as ugly as we thought. But the record for the season isn't looking too hot over here. Over here, it's looking pretty good. I think we're 24, 23, and 14. 23 and 14, 62%. Is that sharp? That's I think sharp. it is. It's That's sharp. sharp. It's sharp. It's what people put, people in the business say, uh, sharp. Uh, Woo-hoo! I'm feeling good today. I'm not going to... I almost did it again, you know? Just knock all this shit Let's not over. do that. Let's not do that. Don't ruin the set. Well, it you know takes, what? It takes a long time. It to didn't work up. last week. Last week when I did that, the Jets won. The Jets so won, it yeah. didn't, you know... Yeah. I also... The editor screwed up the card. He's fired. He's also rehired because we needed someone to edit the show. Woo! All right, we ready? Sure. Long intro, but, you know, it's Fuck important. It. Fuck it. Important. Also, just to address the outfit, wear my boss coat because I'm the boss of the show. And sharp and boss of the show. I'm getting cocky now. That's what happens. It's a downfall. It's, it could be. It could be. Let's find out when we go to my first pick of the week. We got the Eagles at the Jets. And the Jets f***ed me last week. But Royal. not this week. Royally. This week we're taking the Eagles minus six and a half. It's simple. Jets, um... Suck. They had their fun last week. That's all I'm knowing I have in my card. They had their fun last week. And that's it. It's over. They won a game. They're feeling good. They think that like that was it. That's that's it, guys. We won a game. We don't have to do shit anymore. Eagles are still hunting for a playoff spot. They, they got a, they got a chance at that division. Um, Bad loss last week. Well, the Cowboys are slipping on a slippery slope. Well, they just beat the, the sh- you know. slippery slope. It's I, not, the, 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 the division's out of play, but the wild cards up for grabs. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Yeah. Wild card, whatever. That's a playoff spot. It's a playoff spot. Exactly. I wasn't wrong. Uh, I just really like the Eagles in a bounce back uh, game here, even though, I mean, is it a bounce back? What do you mean? They lo- they got killed last week. Yeah. Uh, they got killed. Yeah, I guess they did. They got killed. I guess they did. All right, so uh, it is a bounce back week, and it's a letdown week for the Jets. Minus six and a half Eagles. Uh, that's my first pick. I don't have a lot of analysis for you there. You don't need any. Yeah, I just, that's that's it, though. Wait till you see my analysis for all my picks. Yeah. What was the score of the Eagles game? 13-7. Okay. I mean, that's why, that's why I didn't think it was like a blowout. No, but they they... Because the Giants can't score, but yeah, the Eagles yeah, yeah. got their ass kicked all game. Yeah. yeah. Okay. They couldn't do anything. Yeah, yeah, they turned yeah. turn the ball over four times. That's why yeah. I got confused for a second. I was like, wait a second. I knew it wasn't like a blow-up. No, no, no. Honestly, they should have won. It was ugly. They should have won. It was ugly. That Rager dropped the yeah, ball yeah. at the one-yard line. That's what it was. The two. He had two of those. He did. Oof. That's just great defense, but Oof. it's just great defense. Hard all footsteps. Right. All right. So, um, Animal can attest to this. I come in here. We, we you know, our uh, pre-show meeting... And I'll say, like, three games I really like. And then I take <laughs> three th- completely different three games. Three completely <laughs> different games. And the three I like go 3-0. and oh, And the three I take go 0-3. Oh, so what I did today was not overthink it. I had three games in mind. And these are the three I'm taking. Starting off with, I know you're all going to call me crazy. Snacks, you're a fucking idiot. Yeah. First of all, we know that. Got this whole we new know. system, everybody. We ready? <laughs> it's a whole new thing going on. And I know I'm an idiot. I get it, I get it, I get it. But we're taking the Steelers plus four against the Ravens. 
trick me there. I thought we were going to do something else. Nope. Nope. All right. Uh, no, no. I just, like, my, my, my thought last week was Tomlin, underdog, don't buy into Cincy. I was wrong about Cincy. Cincy's really good. Yeah, they're pretty good. Cincy's a very good team. Good football team. I did not like what I saw from Baltimore last week against, against Cleveland at home. I, I think that team is very banged up. And the Steelers, yes, the Steelers suck. I understand it. But these games are so wacky. And I believe, I believe, I believe I heard this or read this somewhere. I think the, you know what? No, no. Because I, 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 I did trends last week and it did not work whatsoever. Yeah. So I'm not even going to, I'm not even going to bring it up. These division games between the, the, the best rivalry in football, these games are always wacky. Usually it comes down to the last possession. And the Steelers, Tomlin, home underdog. I'm going to take Steelers plus four and a half. This is, the, this is it. They lose, they're done. They need this win desperately. I don't think they get the win, but I think they cover the four and a half. I think the Steelers have been done for weeks. They are uh, done. Possibly since sure. week one, even. Correct. Uh, so Correct. But like I said, these games are always wacky between these two. They're yes. always wacky. Yeah, snacks uh, stay snacking, everybody. All right. Let's go to my second pick of the week. We're going to head over to L.A. to watch the Rams destroy the Jaguars. Uh, Jags at Rams minus 12 and a half. It's a, it's a big number. It, it is. It's a big number. But here's what, here's what I'm looking at. Look at the Rams on a three-game losing streak. I'm looking at the Jaguars, who suck and can barely ever break 20 points. I think they scored 23 points maybe once this this season. They suck. The Rams, I know they're on a slippery slope here, but they're going to bounce back, and this is the week that they do it. Matt Stafford's been playing like shite. Uh, Like what? Like shite. Shite? Shite. What's shite? It's like shit, but shite. It's like bike and back. No, shite's like a real... You never so, heard someone say shite? No. <laughs> uncultured. I, I'm also the most uncultured person. You're un- very uncultured, yeah, yeah. obviously. No. Um, also, some notes here that are kind of relevant, but kind of irrelevant. Uh, the 49ers beat the Rams by 21, and then the 49ers beat the Jaguars by 20. And the, the Rams are playing the Jaguars. <laughs> 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 so I said it's kind of related. But I'm not, not really. understanding the correlation. There's a little there. correlation there. I you mean, gotta, I guess you got to figure it out yourself. There's correlation there, but that I mean, the correlation honestly probably points towards the Jaguars, if anything, right? So, so the Ravens beat the Browns, and I think the Steelers <laughs> beat the Browns. So there, that's uh, I think the correlation actually might lean towards the in the Jags. Favor that's what I was thinking. Yeah, uh-huh. yeah. That's why I was a little confused. Well, we don't care because football doesn't make sense, and it doesn't have to. You know why? Because it's simple, and we're taking the Rams minus twelve and a half. Great pick, love it. Probably my favorite pick of the board, but you had it first, couldn't take it. Sharp, sharp. sharp so what sharp, I'm going to do. You looking for a prop? You want to pull something magic out of a hat? No. Okay. No. Sure? No, I don't. No. Pull, pull something out, magic out of the hat? Okay. You're going to like this bet, I think. I think the Chiefs are playing really well. They're playing good football. Good bet. They're playing very good football. They're home. But nine and a half points against a good Broncos team is too much. We're taking your Denver Broncos Plus nine and a half on the road against Kansas City. They seem to play Kansas City pretty well. They have a good defense. Uh, their offense struggling a little bit, but they had a big win against LA. They are right in the thick of this race. They're they're very they're right there. Playoff uh, team. Winner of this game is uh, first place in the division. Look at that. So a little extra more motivation for Denver. Uh, I think Vic Fangio's defense is gonna. He knows how to stop Mahomes or at least slow him down a little bit. And Mahomes is not exactly shattering the world right now. Neither is that KC offense. I think nine and a half is way too many for a divisional game. And the Broncos aren't no. They're no like walk in the park either. Okay, they keep games close. They keep this one close. Nine and a half is too much. I see Kansas City winning, but probably between four and seven points. And, and that means you cover the nine and a half with Denver. Denver plus nine and a half. The Chiefs are notoriously a bad uh, team against the spread. Correct. They are off. They are the worst team against the spread over the last yeah. three years. Yep. So, so this is a sharp pick. Probably the best pick this guy's had all f***ing year. So, congratulations. That means it's going to lose by 100. Might. It might. We might get blown out. I can see f***ing Tyree Kill going for 220 yards. Travis Kelsey, another 200. Yeah, just absolutely yeah. blown out. Everybody's right. ready for Javante Williams. He may, may gain 20 yards. All right. May. So, uh, normally we would get to the underdog. Uh, play of the day, but this week we got something special for you. We got a big dog pick of the week, courtesy of. You lied to me. I lied again because we don't have one. We're gonna go to the other studio for the underdog play of the day. I ain't starting to piss me off. 
All right, guys. Thanks. That was exciting and a little disappointing. But, you know, it won't be disappointing. These two picks that we give you courtesy of Underdog Fantasy and Underdog Fantasy, the app. Uh, you can download it or something. And uh, I think the promo's over. So I'll give you my first pick. I'm going to go with Cord- your only pick. Daryl. My own. I'm going to give you. I'll give you my only pick. Cordaro Patterson, 75 and a half rushing and receiving yards. We're taking the over. He's the only player on the team. There's really no one else that catches the ball or runs the ball. It's just him. And without him, they stink. Uh, so I expect him to crush this number. He could hit it on rushing or receiving. It doesn't matter. That's what's great about this. Cordaro Patterson. Nice pick. I am going to go over 63 and a half yards receiving for Darnell Mooney. And I love that because Andy Dalton's throwing the ball, not that bum-ass Justin Fields. And the last two games, he's gone over 120 yards receiving. So, book it over 63 and a half yards receiving. Darnell Mooney, Chicago Bears. Book it. And you can uh, combine these picks for a 3x on your money. So, if you bet $30,000, you will win... Nine, $90,000. $90, carry the... Carry the. Why did I go you with don't 30? Have to carry anything, actually. 30,000. 30, 10,000, you win 30,000. Yeah, but that's lame. Yeah. 3 million, you get. Well, we did millions last week, so I want to come down to earth three, a little bit. 3 billion. Billions is, is unrealistic. Like Yannick. Yeah. Not, not ideal. But that's it. That's uh, back to the, the other studio. All right. We are um, those back, are good back, picks back to those the guys. other studio. Snacks is pumped up. He was just dancing or something. What was that? Dude, I'm a, all right. So, real quick side note, I am the best, worst dancer in the world. Does that make sense? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know what you're like I am so like bad. No I've rhythm. got, I've got no rhythm. I've yeah. got nothing, nothing in me, nothing in these scrawny ass fucking legs. But I love dancing, and I'm great at it. You see me at a wedding. Well, I don't stop. Well, I wouldn't say you're great at it if you just said you're the worst. No, 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 no. no. What do you no, like no. to dance to? What's your tip? Oh, did you hear that sound? Do you dance to that? No. Oh. Like Billy Idol, like I like that. Dan Classic dan rock. Dan yeah, dan yeah, yeah. Dan Maybe dan Hell's dan Bells. Did you hear that? I still. Don't. I know you like Hell's Bells though. Love Hell's Bells. Can't yeah, dance to it though. Good, I cried at that. Sound. That's a good sound. Um, yeah, let's just wait for it to ring again. Then you hear it. What, 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 oh, there it is again. Got it. Yep. Got it. Yep. Got it. Yep. Well, I heard it over here though. Yeah, no, that's why I'm telling you. It's my left ear. I pointed over there. I can't hear out of my right. I can't see out of both eyes, and I can only hear out of one ear. Well, am I, am I dying? Uh, <laughs> stroke? I got to go to the doctor on Monday. It's big locks first. Oh, right, right, oh, right. Uh, so that sound and that horrible, possible horrible news means it's time for the big locks. Yep. Hey. All right. So that means it's time for the big locks. I'll start us off as always because I'm the sharper sharp on the show. You've also been starting first every single time for, the <sighs> for last three years, years now. Don't fade animal. But here's the pick. <laughs> it is the Colts mm. at the Texans minus 10. We're taking the Colts. This game already happened. This happened earlier in the year. You know what happened? I can tell you what happened. The Colts won 31 to three. Mm. And you know what else happened? Mm-mm. The Colts have gotten better. As a team, mm. you know what else has happened? The Texans have probably stayed exactly the same. I don't really think they've gotten any better or worse. No, they, I think they got worse. Maybe they've gotten worse, but they haven't gotten better. They lost to the fucking Jets. Sorry, go ahead. It's your pick. No, no, no. No, you're right. They lost to the you're Jets. You're right. They did lose to the Jets. That can't happen. No. But, but I have a new prediction. I have a new score for this week, for this game. And I'll tell you, it's 34 13 wow. Colts. That covers. It covers. And you know what? Last time the, it was 31 3. So what did I do? I said the Colts got better, so they got three points better. Probably not. Three, but you know, 30 is a lot. So 34 points. And then we're going to give the Texans a garbage time touchdown. It's nice of you. Yep. Uh, yes, I mean, it's a, it's, a, it's, it's a great pick. And I, have, field goal I, garbage I, like, time I like all your picks. The Eagles, uh, I don't know. I, I like the last two picks really, really well because I just, I, I can never back. The through. last time I went with the bigger. Reds, I had a, I had a bad week, so oh, you're, you're, you know, you're, you're taking the point right out of my mouth. What you want to do is you don't just erase it. That's going to happen. You're going to have bad weeks. Flush it. Flush it. Flush Go it. right back to it. You don't give a shit. 
Honestly, though, real quick. Right back to it. Real quick. Parlay I'm sorry. I, I know. That's this is you. I, I always interrupt because ah, I'm, I'm f***ing that. It's okay. That is a, those three teams, like if you're into this kind of shit, very good teaser if you do it. Oh, probably, yeah, but I don't do right. teasers. No, 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 I know. I'm saying, but oh, I know a lot of people do. You bring those numbers down. Yeah, teasers good. are for very gutless uh, pussies. <laughs> people bet them. Okay? We're a betting show. Gutless. I got to say, all right, I'm going back to the realm. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm going back to the realm. Made it your big lock. This is my big lock, yeah. It's terrible. Yeah, I'm going to do it. Yeah, I'm going to do it. What team knows one team more, better than anybody in the world? <laughs> Say it. Go ahead. You said team. I know you meant No, oh, well, what, what person knows you, a team better than anybody any in the world? He knows the Giants better than anybody in the world. I agree. 100% I agree. Thank you for saying so. We're taking the Giants plus six and a half in Miami. Yeah, I know Daniel Jones is out. He's pretty. He's got a little straight neck. Listen, I, I, listen, okay, I had cancer and I went to school. He has a straight neck, can't play football. Stop. I don't want to buy it. I, I don't buy it. He's a little bitch. Get him off my team. I'm done with him. Mike Lennon has a neck like a giraffe. That means he could see over the offensive line. He could see over that disgrace of an offensive line. The Giants defense quietly, quietly has been phenomenal. 14 and a half points allowed the last five games. They are, they rank top 10 over those last games. I think they're number six in points allowed. Their defense is playing very, very well. Their secondary is very, very good. Two is playing hot. I give it to you. Two is playing hot. But the Miami with Daniel Jones out, they're going to like, oh, my God, this is a steamroll win. <clears throat> Not this. Not today. Giants plus six and a half. I think Barkley finally gets going a little bit. They get him the ball in space. Galladay finally got seven targets. Glennon's going to throw him the ball. Glennon actually moved the ball pretty well against Dallas when Daniel Jones went out last game. I like it. Six and a half going back to the realm is the only way I know how to win anyway. So I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. I just did it. And by the way, big lock, Giants plus six and a half, plus six and a half, plus six and a half. Take the money line too because they're going to win. Anyway, anyway, you went all favorites. I went all dogs. Yeah, I mean, it's it should be an interesting uh, woof, woof. dynamic. Woof, woof. Listen, you, I, are, you know what's funny? I like you're the, one of your picks. You're the favorite. You're the favorite to finish as the winner of this, and I'm the underdog. So yeah. it kind of. Kind of works out. Yeah, it does a little bit. Giants plus six and a half and money line. All right. Uh, Too easy. There you have it. Snacks going back to the Giants. Uh, going back to what I know. Going back to some big spreads. Should be an interesting week. Make sure you comment your locks uh, down below in the comments. And please like, please subscribe. Uh, what else? You got nip? You got nippy? Nice. Nippy, nippy problem. Maybe I got uh, that's, not fun. that's the show. Thanks for watching. Big, Big loss. Giants plus six and a half.